Hi, my name is Glory Yim and today I'm speaking with Dr. Lim Yijia, an orthopaedic surgeon from Glen Eagles Hospital, who is going to help us answer the question, are women more prone to sports injury? Hi, Dr. Lim, thank you for joining us today. So what are some of the common preconceptions about women and sports injuries? One of the things that we think is that women and men are the same when it comes to sports injuries, but that is not true. Actually, in fact, women are more predisposed to having injuries when they do sports or participate in sports, especially if it's extreme or it's very active or it's contact type of sports. And what are the reasons for this? Uh, number one, um, women are more lax in their ligaments, as in ligament laxity. And secondly, uh, coordination of the joints as well as muscle control. And lastly, in general, the average neck girth of women is actually narrower than the neck girth of men. What other types of injuries are women prone to? Women can have uh, tennis elbow and golfer's elbow injuries. The tennis elbow actually involves inflammation of the tendon um, insertion at this part on the outside of the elbow, which is here. Of course, if it's golfer's elbow, that's just involving the tendon insertion on the other side of the elbow over here. The other injury that's common in women is neck injuries if they participate in contact sports like soccer and rugby. Um, there is also a higher risk of rotator cuff injuries, that means tendon injuries around the shoulder. If we take a look at this, um, this, this uh, model over here, we find that this is the rotator cuff, the muscles are in brown, and the most common tendon, in tendon injury is that of the supraspinatus tendon. Does calcium intake help reduce injuries? Now, of course, calcium per se itself is not sufficient. Um, it is important to have sufficient intake of vitamin D, and of course, a regular exercise will also help to maintain the bone mass as well for women. Is it important to have proper equipment while doing sports? Not only is it important to have proper equipment, but it's important to use equipment properly as well. Is there anything that we as women can do to prevent these types of injuries? So people should be active and women should be active right from young, that's number one. So one of the things we need to do in life is to have a balanced life and even if you do sports, it will vary the type of sports that you do within the week so that we do not overtrain or have overused injuries. Thank you, Dr. Lim. That was very informative. You know, I'm pretty sure many of our lady friends will be rushing to tell their husbands and boyfriends and brothers the science behind it as we speak.